Hello YouTube and welcome for a really exciting video. Yes, yeah, so if you've seen from the title and the thumbnail, today is a get glowed up with me or a week doing like beauty treatments or things I have done or what I have done when I want to feel good. I don't know what the heck I've titled, the, titled this video. Essentially, it's going to be like a glow up week where I have all of my kind of beauty treatments done and I really pamper myself. As you guys can tell, I'm really ill and I've felt a little bit run down for the past couple of weeks, to be honest with you. Um, just due to my room refurbishment, I've had to sleep on the sofa. I've been burning the candle at both ends. I obviously was in Manchester the other week. It's just been a lot and I think it's starting to take a bit of a toll on me. I really wanted to do this video where I essentially have different beauty treatments throughout the week and I tell you guys what I think of them, whether I think they're worth it, what ones I would typically have done, which ones I've never had done before. Just kind of a fun little video. Today, we are starting out by getting HD brows, which I've never had before, so I'm super excited. I'm going to a girl called Rebecca. I am gonna leave everyone's information below, by the way, who I go to. So if you're in the Hertfordshire area, or like the North London area, and you wanna travel, or if you're in the London area and you wanna travel, whatever, you maybe wanna try these people out, or you're just interested in stalking their Instagrams. I'm gonna leave all of that relevant information below because I'm gonna be having nails done, lash extensions. Today I'm getting my HD brows done, which I'm really excited about because I've never had my brows HD before and I've always wanted them done. And I'm gonna have like a little kind of like dermaplaning, pl dermaplaning facial type thing done. Obviously not too much around this area, but we're gonna do like this and this. And I just wanna show you a little bit about what she has to offer. Um, she's got a stunning Instagram account, this girl. I've never gone to her before. So I'm super excited to see how today kind of goes. Hopefully she's gonna make me look like a new woman. The aim is to look like a different person by the end of this week. You guys will see how I'm gonna go from this to this. So yeah, fingers crossed it's going to be a good transformation video, but yeah, I need to get my socks on because I'm running late already. I'm just super excited to take you in there, show you like what she does, she's going to do a bit of filming, we'll take some pictures, and yes, I will leave everyone below, don't you worry. I've been going to like my lash lady forever, I actually had a break for about a month, but I'm having them put back on on Thursday. My nail girls I've been going to for ages, um, and this girl seems fab, so I'm really, really excited. Obviously I will give you all a rundown, and I will let her kind of talk more about what she is actually going to be doing today for me and I just think this couldn't have come at a better time I feel really crap to be quite honest but it's fine we're having loads of we're having a pamper week I can't be moaning so let's get our skates on and let's get going <laughs> We are in the car, we are on our way to our first beauty treatment. I really do apologize for how frightening I look. I have no tan on, I have no mascara, lashes. I just look very scary, I think, and it's my lack of sleep. So I'm really sorry everyone, I'm probably terrifying you all today. <laughs> Hi guys, so I look a little bit crazy because um, I've got this thing which is obviously pushing my hair back but oh my god, how much better do my eyebrows look right now? They are so amazing. I'm going to leave obviously her Instagram and everything like that below so you can check them out because you do fluffy brows as well, oh don't gosh, you? Yeah, it's yeah. a new treatment. Yeah, which is really cool. So now I'm addicted, I'm going to be getting these all the time, I'm not going <laughs> to lie. I'm going to be in here all the time. I just can't believe that this is like my eyebrows. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah, they're so great. Make that looks like makeup, makeup as well. Fake tan, dead skin cells, hair. Oh my! I'm so sorry that you had to do that. <laughs> <laughs> Look what you just my got job. off my face, guys. That is atrocious. <laughs> I am back. I have finished my facial. My skin looks a little bit pinky. It's not actually too red. Um, I do have like sensitive-ish skin. Like I have the kind of skin that goes red, like from anything. So it's kind of inevitable, but. She's put on like a really nice hydrating moisturizer. It feels amazing on my skin. Um, it was such a nice facial. So nice to like chill out and zen out. And like it's really helped me like mentally. Like I know this video is like a glow up video. I know it's about like feeling glam and like getting things done and like feeling great and whatever. And like the whole aesthetic, but she's like the loveliest girl ever. Like we got on so, so well. Like, I never have things like this done, so. I don't know, it was just, it was nice to just sit and 
chill out. Hi guys, so update number two. Obviously we've gone and had the brows done, we had the facial yesterday, um, and that was all amazing and fantastic. I had the derma planning, I think that's how you say it, glow facial, which I've always wanted to have. It's where they take like a little razor and they like shave off all the gross stuff of your face um which i think i showed you that because honestly it was so disgusting that poor girl and i think because i wear fake tan it was like a lovely orangey shade so that was really lovely so relaxing um and like i said if you are in hertfordshire i'll leave all of her sort of information in the description box but today we are going to have my lashes put back on which i'm not gonna lie i couldn't be more excited about i have missed having my lashes so much that I am just I'm it's gonna be the best day I'm also gonna have a new fresh set of nails done so I'm gonna have like a full fresh set done just because I've had these for a really long time and they're getting a bit old now this is what these are looking like before one time I didn't get gel polish and the color has gone horrible so always get gel polish basically is the moral of that story um I don't really know what I'm gonna go for I might do like kind of like coffin shape so like in between square and like pointed but i don't know what color i'm very unsure so we're gonna go and figure all of that out today back here and then i'll go to my lash appointment so yeah we're really getting things going which is a bit of a relief because honestly guys i've been lashless for too long now it's made me so sad um i was gonna try out lvl which i'm still really interested in so let me know if you've had that in the comment section because yeah, that's something that I would probably consider having like when I don't have my lashes on, but I've heard like really good things and really not so good things, so I just thought, do you know what, have my lashes put back on, I'll be happy. Hey guys, what's happened to this country? Is it me or is it suddenly gone freezing? Like honestly, I am so cold, I don't understand. I didn't film in the salon, uh, in the nail place, just because I didn't have anyone to help me film and I couldn't film like both my hands like at the same time it was really awkward um which is really annoying but this is what i went for i had a full fresh set done let's see if we can focus on these here we go and i had some designs which i know is not to everyone's taste but i personally love a little design i think why not it kind of brightens my day so i went for this shellac color which i don't know the color of this i know it's 159 from opi in the shop that i go to um but i know it's a Heli hello kitty color then i literally just had like a nudie color on my index and ring finger with some little white stripes and dots and then i had a little black heart i just think it's kind of cute i love the shape i'm really happy i went for square i wanted something a little bit different does anyone when they have new nails like want to like show off their new nails anyone seen that meme when it's like a girl and she's got new nails and she's like going like this so i'm feeling so under the weather but i'm so glad i'm doing this like pamper week because it's really helping me to feel a little bit better so now i'm off to get my lashes done oh my gosh this is like one of the most exciting things i've been for for this video is my lashes i am in desperate need of having them put back on they are just me and i miss myself without them so yeah we're gonna go get our lashes done i might grab a coffee on the way if i've got time because i need something i've not had anything all day Yes. Oh, it's got different settings. Yeah. Mine doesn't. Oh, do they not? Mine's not got that warm setting. Yeah, it warm. Oh, that's quite nice. Oh, it's like flattering. What one would you like? Um, oh, here we are. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I still look like absolute. <laughs> okay, everyone, so I'm here. And I couldn't be more excited. I feel like it's Christmas Day. I'm not going to lie because I'm getting my lashes fit back on. Everyone in the comments is going to think I'm insane. So I've come back to my lash girl who I've had so many of you ask me all the time where I get my lashes done. And I will leave it in the description box. If you're in like the Hertfordshire area, and she's based around there, but she also does like microblading, semi permanent, I yeah, I know tattoo, loads of stuff. So I'll leave her Instagram below if you're interested in any of that. But I'm so excited and I will also post like four and a half like a little photo on the screen now of my last before and my last after yeah I'm gonna sit here and look at it so I'm trying to take it what's your preference do you like rap or rock more whatever that you like I got it all for you so what did you I got a lot more so what you wanna hear cause I don't really care Cause I got time to spare, but I don't got time to waste So, what's your music taste? Lot of trouble, lot of bass Lot of trouble, lot of bass Lot of trouble, lot of trouble Hello everyone, and I got my lashes back <laughs> I'm so happy, like honestly this just changes my whole mood And I know some of you are gonna think I'm absolutely crazy, but 
something about having lashes just makes me feel so much more comfortable and confident and it's just something I like to do. So I have just finished having my lashes done. It's really nice having like a fresh set of lashes. Sorry, I don't really know where to look. See, I showed you a little bit of what we got up to in there, but Alicia is absolutely amazing. Um, I will link her Instagram. She does other things other than lashes. Um, she does do microblading for your brows. She does um, tattooing, semi-permanent makeup tattooing. See, I showed you a little bit of what we got up to in there, but Alicia is absolutely amazing. Um, I will link her Instagram. She does other things other than lashes. Um, she does do microblading for your brows. She does um, tattooing, semi-permanent makeup tattooing. She does um, areola tattooing for people that want to have that done that have maybe gone through something which, you know, they want nipple tattooing, things like that. So she does a lot of stuff and she's the nicest girl, really easy to get on with, so comfortable to talk to about anything. If you have any questions for her, um, she's she's really honestly great. I've been coming to her for like two years, so I truly do love her. I feel so lucky that I found a really good girl near me that does lashes and she's great. So that's today. We've got the nails done. We got the lashes done. The other day, obviously I have my brows done, which I'm loving my brows at the moment. I have no product in my eyebrows right now. And I just think they look so great. She did such an amazing job, that girl, of my brows. So thank you so much, Rebecca, for my brows. And obviously she did my facial, which my cheeks feel amazing. I think it was a really good time of year to get a facial. But it's starting to get a bit dried out from the central heating. So I'm really happy that I did that. Um, and yeah, I've still got to finish this glow up. I've still got to do full face of makeup, full hair. We're going to do it all so that it really is like a transformation video. Um... But yeah, I think this is so much more than aesthetic. And I really want you guys to remember that. Like, obviously we're doing this to kind of have all of the fun little things done. But also, like, this is just feeling confident and, like, having pampering yourself. Like, I find getting my nails done really relaxing. So I enjoy that experience. So for me, it's a little bit of self-care as well. Anyway, I'm going to get home eat my um, quinoa salad that's next to me because I'm hungry. Hey, guys. So we are on to the final leg of this video. Um... I have had brow, HD brows done, a facial done this week. I've had my nails done. I have had uh, my lashes infilled. And now we are going to go and have our makeup done. I am so unbelievably excited to bring you guys along. We're going to be going to an amazing makeup artist. I will leave her Instagram below. She's called Emma. And I've actually done a video with her before on this channel. So I'll drop a link to that if you are interested in knowing like more about her and kind of what she does. Because that video is a lot more in depth than this one will be. But I am so excited to go over there. I also did apply a layer of fake tan last night. Um, I was going to film that, but I've kind of decided that I'm actually going to do like a full fake tan routine in a couple of weeks um, or next week, just because this is the time of year when I fake tan loads and I don't in the summer. So I think I would leave that for a whole separate video. But that's enough of me just babbling on. We are going to go and I will obviously bring you with, talk through the products that Emma uses on me, show you guys what I look like when she's done my makeup. I am so excited to get my makeup done. You don't understand. I literally never leave the house like this. And my, this area with the central heating, like honestly, my skin is so dry. Um, so I'm just trying to use loads of moisturizer at the minute. Anyway, let's get going. I got time to spare, but I don't got time to waste. So what's your music taste? Lot of trouble, lot of bass. Lot of trouble, lot of bass. Lot of trouble, lot of so guys this is my f the finished product i obviously showed you guys what i like before which was just a right state so i am really obsessed like i never do this with my eyes so i really really like it that's the good thing about having somebody else do your makeup is like they do things that you were like are too scared to do, do you know what I mean? So I am gonna leave all of Emma's stuff in the description box below if you wanna go check her out. She's on Instagram. She is based like Hertfordshire, mm. London, Essex. Essex. Yeah, she'll, she'll travel, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> um, but it's lovely, I really like it. This highlight is lovely as well, what's this? Becca. Champagne pot. Yeah. Oh, I love that. that it. on you last night? It breaks on me, I, I, I've owned mm. loads, but they crack on me. Is it because I'm throwing my makeup bag around, probably? What do you mean they crack? Like, like oh, they, like, it, physically. It, oh, yeah. because they're really soft. Yeah. Yeah. But it's lovely. I love it. Thank you. You're welcome. Hey, guys. So, it is raining, and you can probably hear the rain. But I thought I'd come on here and just, like, chat to you a bit more now. I've had it done. Um, and let's put my hair up so we can 
really really get the full effect i have never ever done like a smoky eye and i love it i think it's really nice with blue eyes um oh there's someone behind me i am like nearly obsessed with this actually like i've never done it before and i love it i also love my brows how she's done my brows she does skin so well like she makes the skin look lovely and dewy but it's still you know it's locked in like she's you know she's powdered me but this highlight here it just looks so nice honestly guys i've had my makeup done by amber before she's really really great um and like i said i am gonna leave her below she'll do whatever you really want if you want something like a soft glam if you want a natural if you want like more of a dramatic glam um yeah am i out of breath i've literally walked to the car honestly i'm really excited i feel like this is getting really near the end now of my like glow up with me i am gonna go home pop in my new extensions that have arrived which i get so many questions about those so i'm gonna go home and put them in and talk to you about the extensions that i use and then we are actually done with this glow up with me we're actually kind of sad about it. like it's been so much fun having all these little treatments done throughout the week that i don't want it to finish so yeah i'm gonna go home sort myself out and then i will check back in okay guys so the next thing i want to talk to you about on this glow up video this glow up with me video is these extensions i ordered two sets of extensions from foxy locks i ordered these which are the 16 inch latte blonde extensions but they're only in the 150 grams so it's the smallest grams i believe you can get on the website this is my exact match this is the color that i wear oh we're zooming in this hair color is my exact match this is the color that i wear in my hair every time you see me with extensions in it is latte blonde i have a set that i have toned but when they arrive they're a gorgeous color i think um like not too ashy but like a really lovely blonde so this is my color i get so many of you ask me about foxy locks i've bought from them for about four or five years but yeah i have been buying from foxy locks for about four years i bought every single set of extensions myself they have never sent me any and i have never ever worked with them as a brand which guys really brings me down you know how much i love them i am such a fan i spent 300 pounds on the website the other day so i'm a big foxy looks fan this is the color that i'm gonna wear i'm gonna pop in the 16 inch ones just because they're better for like the daytime they blend a little bit bit better um and yeah i am truly obsessed with them you guys know how much i adore their extensions if you have any questions i am thinking of doing an entire video about them and just like how i style them because obviously i do like my top knot with them i do my high ponytail with extensions a bit up and a bit down i pr pretty much have them in like every day so because this is my hair without them um but the color is just like such a good color match for me so i'm going to pop these in and then i'm going to show you guys me finished and my finished overall look for this glow up with me hey guys so i have just clipped in the 16 inch foxy locks extensions bearing in mind guys i have not curled them styled them cut them uh like i would probably go and curl these which is probably what i'm going to do in a minute i just wanted to show you how amazingly they blend pretty much the color is so lovely um they're a really good length, 16 inch, if you want like a natural looking extension. Like literally I could put my hair into like a little ponytail and it's just a really nice thick pony. So yeah, I would recommend this length if you want kind of like natural looking extensions. I honestly love these so much. I wish this was an ad. This is not an ad. I wish that this was like gifted. It's not gifted. I literally spent 300 pounds on the website. I love their extensions. Honestly, I am so 100% real when it comes to these and I get so many questions about what hair extensions I wear. So I've put them in, my makeup's done. We had the nails done this week. We had the HD brows. We had a facial done. And then I had my eyelash extensions done, which are looking fab. So this is everything. This is my glow up with me style video. All of the different things I have done when I want to feel really good about myself. Bearing in mind, this is obviously, you know, exasperated, like as in I've pushed this to the edge, like I would never normally go and have my makeup done. I would never normally go and have a facial, but I wanted to make it a little bit more entertaining for you guys and show you all the different things that you can have done and what suits different people. If you want to pick one of these things out of the month or just to kind of show you. Um, I know that glowing up is kind of a bit of an unusual term but i personally find these kinds of things for me very therapeutic i find them really relaxing they're really good for my kind of state of mind they make me feel really good about myself and uplift me so i know not everything is based on the exterior 
but it's nice to pamper yourself sometimes and feel good about yourself. So yes, a big shout out to all of the girls that were involved in this video. Thank you so much to Rebecca, Alicia and Emma. You are all fabulous and I will leave all of their links below like I said earlier if you are interested in checking them out and if you have any questions about anything in particular that I had done this week, um, drop me a comment. Do not forget to like this video if you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments if you want me to do videos like this in the future. It's something a little bit different from my channel. Um, don't forget to hit subscribe. Check me out on Insta. And I will catch all of you guys in my next video. Bye.